The avocado has become one of the trendiest foods in the world. With more people conscious about eating healthy, this superfood is a mainstay for food lovers everywhere. With the new avocado craze, Kakuzi PLC made a bold move to clear their coffee plantations, which had become less profitable, and developed avocado orchards over the years. The first avocado plantings were, were put out. And originally, it was going to be 200 hectares of avocados. Just to put that in perspective, we're about 900 hectares now, and we'll be about 1,200 hectares by the time we're finished. Kakuzi has continued with avocado planting and has even upgraded the pack house, which now doubles Kakuzi's processing capacity and is sufficiently coping with increasing crop levels for future demands. There is a continuous growth of demand for, shall we say, high quality products that are grown to meet consumers' values. Um, and so it, it was a concerted effort to, to look at avocados. It was going to be a small crop back in 96, but it's grown into something which is probably one of the largest avocado producers. The global market has been responding positively to Kenyan avocados due to the high potential for good quality fruit and for Kakuzi to secure this market, it has stepped up its effort to strengthen the capacity of its smallholder farmers. We have 80% uh, of our avocados meeting the international standards uh, and 20% going into the local market. Kakuzi offers extension services and training to 3,500 smallholder farmers to maximize production. There are those farmers who have already mature trees. There are starters who want to purchase seedlings from our nurseries and they want to be guided through that process. But our main aim is to provide access to the international market to these farmers and also enable them to grow their fruits in the right way that is acceptable even in the, in the international market. In 2020, Kakuzi Avocado smallholder farmers received a payment of 57.9 million shillings and access to the growing international market. Tangu huyo wakati nimeonelea ni afadhali kukaa kwa kikundi hata bei kuliganisha na ile ilikuwa hapo mbeleni ya brokers ya huku ni afadhali. Ovacado ukiwa kwa kikundi utapata pesa kwa sababu nyinyi mnaleta kwa kampuni. Na hiyo kampuni Kakuzi is not all about avocados. They also engage in the cultivation, processing and marketing of macadamia nuts, blueberry, tea, livestock and commercial forestry products. And in all, they use technology and innovation to practice sustainable farming. In any modern uh, agriculture enterprise, there are five key pillars that would ensure uh, sustainability. Uh, that is uh, food safety, food quality, traceability, environmental sustainability, and legality. The ability to trace our farm produce and the ingredients where they apply all the way along the supply chain from the farms up to where the consumer meets the product. It is important Kwakuzi because we are able to assure food safety to our consumers. What I mean is that in the event of a recall or a withdrawal, we have enough information that we can use to easily retrieve, save time and cost, and be able to assure consumer safety by using the traceability.